Welcome back friends. In this video we're going to talk about that four letter word which is L-O-V-E which is love and how that is the fundamental basis of your mediumship. Big kisses from me in the spirit world. Afternoon YouTube, it is I, Danielle, better known as Danielle Hat Medium, and welcome back friends. It's a pleasure to have you all here with me, and I hope everybody is fitting well here on the channel. And in today's video tutorial, and the mechanics made easy, we're going to talk a little bit about the four letter word, which is love, and how this is missed massively in development, training, or anything else out there in the industry. And what fundamentally we do mediumship for. For me, it was one of the big topics that the spirit world brought to me. The spirit world really wanted to talk about love because what we have forgotten within the industry, as my people put to me, is, is that what we're actually connecting to the spirit world for. And the connection is the love between the people in the spirit world and the people down here. And we've lost that sort of sense of purpose we've lost that reason as to why we do what we do for mediumship like i say i've seen lots of development out there there's lots of training i do it you know i mean i'm not here to to say anything differently about these things i hope you like the kisses by the way it's kisses from the spirit world from me to you and everything else but what we really want to talk to you about is the fact that that's what we're connecting on we're connecting on this vibration of love we're connecting on this vibration to reunite the spirit world with the loved ones and we miss this so much within the movement and one of the things that lots and lots of students ask me and talk to me all the time about I want that emotion in my spirit in my spirit work it's not I would like it's I want um, but people ask me all the time like how do I get that emotion and communication how do I how do I get that empathy over Danielle how do I sort of get these things sort of in place in order so that I can get this connection one is that is the power of love and it is fundamentally one of the things that binds us all together whether it be the medium whether it be the general public we are all interconnected through the power of love so in this video me and the, my team in the spirit world really wanted to talk to you a little bit about that and i was going to give you some hints and tips on how it is that you could maybe look to connect better on that vibration which will also eliminate the fear factor which lots and lots of you have and also check in with you the medium because I mean, the medium needs to be, the instrument needs to be in the best place possible, which is the medium to me and you. And the exercise I want to give you today was to take a couple of deep breaths. So I'll just wait for you lot. A couple of deep breaths. And I want you to put your hand on your heart. So here's Mimi Jumper. Hand on my heart. And I want to ask yourself today, how much do you love yourself? And you should get it back in a percentage. And if you're under the 50% percentage, then there's work to do on you as the instrument. And if you're not connecting on that vibration of love, then you're not connecting with the inner being, which is you, which is the instrument. Now, like I say, lots and lots of people asked me, how do you get emotion in your communications, Danielle? I see you are talked about, Danielle, for bringing emotion and, you know, tears and things like that to demonstrations of mediumship. Fundamentally, because I've learned to love myself more. I've learned that by connecting to myself through the love vibration, my connection to the spirit world is a lot easier. And it makes things easier for me to be able to communicate with the loved ones in the spirit world because they're all coming, whether it be evidence, whether it be, you know, training, development, whatever it is, if it's not done because of the word love or not done on that vibration of love, then you're always going to struggle in some capacity because them in the spirit world, that's what they're connecting on. They're connecting on that love vibration. And if you don't quite love yourself enough, then how are you meant to be able to get that communication over? So, and it is one of the mechanics that's massively missed in the, I, I searched all over YouTube. I'll be honest with you, right? Cause I, no, I didn't believe my team, you know what I mean? But I thought I'll go away, I like to do research. When, when my spirit team talk to me about something, I go away and I research and I go away and I look at it. I'll see it from a human perspective. And I couldn't find one video out there. Not one mechanic, not one development, not one training on the word love. Or how, how connecting on the love vibration would help your mediumship in some capacity. 
you know, all them videos, millions of videos across YouTube, not one. I couldn't believe it, I was absolutely, I even went on to Google and checked on Google, nothing, nothing. All on mechanics, all on, you know, development, on the clear range, or, you know, the mind, and but nothing on the vibration of love. There was some on God, but God, you know, I, I, it's not I don't believe in God, it's just I believe that there's, there's I don't believe there's one set energy that is <clears throat> fundamentally saying over every energy. I think every energy has an opportunity to be able to help another energy in some capacity. I think we're all working as a collective of love. Um, but yeah, not one. So in this video and in this tutorial, and one that I think is fundamentally massively needed in the movement, ask yourself how much do you love yourself today and what can you do to improve that each and every day? And how you, by connecting on that love vibration, will help you better get that link to the spirit world. I've been Danielle, better known as Danielle Happy Medium, and I'll see you all tomorrow night for a live Q&A. It was meant to be on Sunday, but unfortunately, um, something got in the way, a family as always. <laughs> Happens, with the best of ability. Yeah, so definitely back tomorrow night doing a live Q&A, and then I'll see you. It may not be an upload on Thursday, depending, I am away um, demonstrating down south, but um, I might take the laptop with us and see what I can get done down there. It's been a pleasure talking to you all. I'll see you all uh, tomorrow night. Bye for now.